several years ago, a pair of Southwest Idaho women came together over their shared passion for pickling. That passion has since turned into a full-fledged, full-time business with products now popping up on store shelves across the Gem State and beyond. Yeah, in this week's Made in Idaho, Rachel Garceau takes us to Dilly's Pickled Veggies, where a whole lot more than cucumbers are contributing to this lip-smacking success story. Jessica Norris knows her way around a pickle jar. We pickle things. We pickle all the things. Norris is the owner and founder of Dilly's Pickled Veggies, a cuna based business that brines and bottles a variety of vegetables. We do green beans, jalapenos, cauliflower, red onions, and this year we'll be launching carrots as well. And while delicious, ironically pickles themselves aren't the fan favorite. Our asparagus is hugely popular. It's our best seller. We sell more than double of our spicy asparagus than any other product. Dilly's got off the ground several years ago when Norris joined forces with another local pickle producer. After a couple of years of working together and training under her, she retired. I took over all of, all of the company and all of our products and we grew from there. So much so that eventually Dilly's needed a dedicated place to perfect its pickling process. We decided ultimately that we wanted to build our own space, and so we built here in CUNA. The veggies Dillies uses are sourced as often as possible from right here in the Treasure Valley. When we pull asparagus locally, we pull it from Frower Farms and Owyhee Produce, and we pull majority of our green beans from Lakeview Fruit in Caldwell. Also cucumbers from Eastern Oregon and Parma, all picked fresh and used at their peak. We hand pack everything into jars and then our spices are added and we add our brine. And from the juice to the jar, you can use pretty much every part of a Dilly's pickled product. They can be snacks. You can add them to anything. We cook with them all the time. We save the brine for recipes. We'll do like a pickled brine pork chop. A lip smacking success story that Norris credits to being a made in Idaho company. So it's just the friendliness of it and people supporting a local brand has been wonderful. Rachel Garceau, Idaho News 6. Okay, so if you want to try out Dilly's pickled um, veggie or two for yourself, you can find them at Market Street and Broadway, Albertson Stores, and the Boise Co-op and Idaho State Liquor Stores. Now, if you want to find out more about Dilly's, you can look for this story um, on our uh, website. That's, of course, Idaho News 6, and it's the Made in Idaho tab there. And this morning, even though she can't be here uh, in person, we're going to try out some of these samples that Rachel left for us. And I think, Matt, which one do you have right uh, now? I just, I kind of just... Just jumped in there and picked something. I have the mild asparagus. Nice. Let's see if I can open have this. Have you tried oh. it? I have oh. not yet. Uh, oh, no. Can... I was going to try one right now. Let's see if I can snag one right here. So mild asparagus, first Just off. At 5.33 in the morning. Yeah. Enjoy. Pungent. <laughs> Very pungent. <laughs> That'll wake you up. Yeah, I'm definitely awake right now. Um, oh, that's great. Oh, my goodness. Wow. Oh, um, he's going to eat that whole jar. I'm okay. thinking about it. It is sitting next to me and no one else is here. So uh, I guess <laughs> I'm see. eating a, a jar of pickled asparagus. At, this one she left me is yeah. a mild green beans. And I, my mom used to make green beans uh, that were pickled. Oh, nice. So we're going to see if she uh, is better than my mom here. Is, her, gonna... is your mom named Dilly? <laughs> I don't think it's her place then. Oh, so good. Mm. Oh, so good. You hear the crunch? Well, Man, that keeps that crunch. I love that, crunch? that. Yeah, I used to put them on um, sandwiches. Oh, nice. Mm -hmm. Green beans, huh? Mm-hmm. Hmm. Yeah. Was there a Ooh, spicy you, asparagus down there? I, Wherever you are. I missed that one. <laughs> I'll, I'll have to come back to that. Anyway, that's delicious. Rachel, mm -hmm. uh, wherever you may be, thank you. Thank you. For, uh, for that story and, and these delicious dillies. Stuff. Yes. Yum.